Hey guys, it's Jagle. Welcome back, and today we are going to talk about how to get this sick-ass snowman mount and the Starlight Festival in Final Fantasy XIV, which actually super surprised me this year. So, let's start out by heading to New Gridania, and then we're going to use the Etherite to teleport to Maketo's Amphitheater in Old Gridania, and that's where our quest giver is going to be, just like it was last year and the year prior. Uh, you'll see it's kind of like set up for the Starlight Festival with all the decorations as usual, and it looks fantastic. So we're going to go ahead and pick up the quest from Am um here, and what's going to happen is they're going to tell us the tale of Saint Nimia, or Santa Claus, or um, this guy here in the dress. But anyway, he's going to tell us that there's been uh, a shortage of Christmas cheer throughout the realms, and... Uh, we need to change that. So, you guessed it, we're going on a bunch of fetch quests. So after a little bit more RP with jolly old Saint Nick, we are going to be given a little box. Sort of advent calendar-esque, if you will. Very holiday feeling. It's about to pop up on your screen right now. Uh, as we progress through this starlight festival storyline we're going to be opening the little containers on this box and inside is going to be some different items mostly going to be like firework consumable type stuff visual consumable type stuff uh really cool if you're into taking screenshots or using gpose tool you can really uh spice up your work with that if you know what you're doing as far as like lighting and stuff goes uh other than that some other really cool things about this christmas event that were notable is there's actually like a point where they have you read letters like holiday letters you've received from people that we've met throughout the storyline which i thought personally was a super nice touch because here we have characters that we haven't talked to since like heaven sword years ago that are sending us letters to see how we're doing and spreading christmas cheer i thought it was a really really nice touch uh from square enix so if we keep plugging away at this quest line eventually we are going to reach a point where we have these two snowman here what's going on here is we have to decorate the snowman in the image of this guy's parents to remind him that he has a heart or some shit and that that's what Christmas is all about. So the thing that I thought was really really cool about this quest is they actually give you like a description of them and different items to pick from and you have to actually decorate them yourself. Now I don't know if this is even possible to fail because I did it on the first try. I don't know if it's just anything you put on works or if there's uh, certain item requirements but if you just follow the way that I did it you will definitely progress through this quest. Uh, I believe I did green scarf and red top hat and then a red scarf and a green knit cap. It says something about them wanting to be matching. So basically you just kind of want to like alternate the colors on the two of them. And once you finish this, that's it guys. You will have your snowman mount and you will have completed the Starlight Festival for 2020. Uh, I had a lot of fun with this event. I thought it was really, really great, and I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. And I appreciate everybody for taking the time to come by the channel and check out the video. And I hope you guys have an awesome holiday, whatever you may be celebrating today or this weekend, whatever. I, I hope it's great, and you guys have some good times. And I can't wait to see you guys here next year when we get back on the Final Fantasy grind. Thank you so much again for watching, and if you guys enjoyed the video or have enjoyed any of my videos in the in the past, you know, don't hesitate to hit that subscribe button. It really helps support the channel, and uh, just know that there's more Final Fantasy content coming. I'm gonna have a a job, a combat job leveling guide is going to be coming very soon. That's something I've been in the works on, and I appreciate your guys' patience. These guides take a lot of time to make, just because of compiling information and actually grinding out you know, the content in game, then scripting and making a video. It's a lot. So I appreciate you guys, you know, being patient in between uploads as I work to try to make the best content I can. And thank you. I hope you guys have an awesome day. Merry Christmas.